Range fans, range fans, we're back at it on the 50-yard line with a 10-22 Ruger Rimfire. We've got some SK Long Range match, which I haven't seen in a while. Was able to get some here lately. And you've seen this old thing before, Ruger 10-22 takedown, but you have not seen it with this Summit Precision Silver Carbon Fiber Wrapped Barrel. Yes, it is a 22 long rifle that uh, now has a bull barrel associated with the takedown name, something we all have been waiting for. It's around about 30 degrees out here today. The Summit Precision Barrel is a pretty decent barrel in the regular uh, Ruger 1022 format, but in the takedown format, this is the first one I've seen online as a whole and I'm happy to bring it and share it with you, especially for my son. You all know that this is his rifle. We're gonna see how this thing shoots. I've got 30 rounds of SK long range match loaded up. This is the first shot here at 50 yards. This thing is so finely done. You can't even tell that it's threaded from the end. It has a really nice crown on the muzzle. Um, Man, just an overall nice looking setup in and of itself. Let's see how this thing shoots. Enough with the chip chat. Let's see how this thing shoots. Oh boy. We're gonna put 10 rounds on that first target. Let's see what the summit can do. Hopefully make my son jealous. Oh, that was a little high, but you know what? Hey guys, if you take a look at that group, what? There are six or seven of them down there in the same exact hole. Come on, Summit Precision. I think that is a tad bit better group than the factory barrel we had on here. We're gonna go to the next target over, put another 10 rounds. We just wanna see where this thing shoots today. I needed to get out of the house, a little bit of cabin fever. We'll see what's going on. Summit Precision, first shots fired from a takedown barrel. Y'all know what? Hey, I'll take that. Because this thing is still not fully free floated because this was a pencil barrel setup, a factory barrel setup. I did have to take a gunsmithing tool to hog the front end of the stock out. And yeah, it's touching. It's not fully free floated. Should I fully float it? You guys tell me what you think. Last 10 rounds. I think this Summit Precision Takedown if you guys looking for a bull barrel, 16 inches, 16.1 inches, I think it is. If you're looking for a bull barrel for your takedown, you may not have any reason to look any further than Summit Precision. Oh, let's make these last 10 count. Mm. 
Whoa, huh? And there you have it, a couple of flyers in that one, but still, I think it does shoot a tad bit better. You can go over to dayattherange.com and check out how the factory barrel was shooting. Maybe I'll roll in some B footage right here to show you how that factory pencil barrel was shooting. I think this thing does shoot smaller groups, but we'll take some measurements, post them over at dayattherange.com. Tell me what you think about this beautiful setup now. Ruger 1022 takedown, Summit Precision, bull barrel, 16 inch, threaded, beautiful. Next time, see this thing with a suppressor and tell my son, get himself well so we can get out to the range and really ring this thing out. Just wanted to make a quick video for you. Thanks for having me. Thanks for being out here with me on dayattherange.com.